The football helmet is the single most broken item I will point to in the entire game. It may not be the strongest item in the entire game, but it is absurdly powerful for how cheap it is. A football helmet costs one pigskin and one rope at an alchemy engine to prototype. To get the pigskin, I always break down pig houses with a hammer or pig heads, which will spawn in the swamp and by touchstones. And rope is just three grass refined, and that's easy peasy. It absorbs 80% of physical damage and has 315 HP of durability. Additionally, it gives 20% wetness resistance and does not lose any durability for providing this function. This means as long as you have a football helmet on and as many additional football helmets as you need, you will effectively take five times less damage. For a normal character, that would mean your HP is actually now 750 instead of the normal 150. That's absurd damage resistance, and it's pretty much the whole reason why it's OP. What I would recommend is that you always wear your football helmet unless you need to wear an umbrella instead during spring. This will save you from any sneak attacks and protects against almost every type of damage. It even works against Charlie's attacks for walking through the dark too long. Then you can also keep a stack of pigskin on you, specifically in your backpack, so if you die, nothing eats it, and then just craft another one whenever you need it. This won't take up much inventory space at all and allows you to get into big fights wherever you go and come out just fine. Also, if you don't have an umbrella in spring, if you wear an umbrella with a football helmet, that will provide 100% wetness resistance, which is important so you can dry off by a fire, otherwise the fire does nothing for the wetness. For players in late game, you might find that pig houses to break down are starting to get rare because you've already broken so many down. Set up pig houses by the moonstone event then with an unreachable, non-perishable food source nearby so the pigs get stuck going after. And with the moonstone encased, in structures the enemies can't break, such as end tables. Then start the event, wait until they howl at the moonstone, and take the staff out to stop the event. This will kill many of them. Repeat until they're all dead. This is a very scalable farm that works fast, unlike normal pig farms. If you don't want to build such a big scale farm, put a few next to your base and kill the were pigs every full moon, or feed them for monster meat to turn them into were pigs and kill them then for a guaranteed pig skin instead of just a chance at pig skin. And that's it! Like the video if you did, and subscribe for more.